Hi, I'm Richie with Manning Innovations, and today we're going to be shooting a tensile test bar specimen. Uh, specifically, this is a ASTM designation 638-14 type 4 tensile test specimen, also called a dog bone by many. Uh, we're going to be utilizing the Protoject 150 HP, our high pressure machine, with a 15 ton hydraulic clamp and our newest electric hydraulic power unit. So let's get started. Always remember uh, when you're injecting a mold of any type, uh, you're dealing with hot molten plastic, so make sure you have all the personal protective equipment that is recommended, including long sleeves, gloves, and safety glasses, or even face shields. All right, uh, to get started, we simply load the mold. The mold has been uh, already centered into the clamp, and our backstops are all set, and so we're ready to go. We just close the hydraulic valve on the pump, activate the push button, and wait for the pressure to rise. You can tell by both the sound and the visual indication when you have reached 10,000 PSI on the gauge, you're now at your full rated pressure for whatever clamp you're using. Again, in this case, it's the 15 ton clamp. We're now ready to inject. I see a little drool, so we're going to pull that drool off, discard that, and now we're ready to inject by pulling down on the injection handle, and you can just count in your head uh, whatever you think is uh, necessary for the part. In this case, I'm going to do about 10 seconds. Release the handle. Wait a few more seconds for the part to cool in the mold. And then we'll, we'll release the hydraulic valve on the power unit. The clamp will retract. And now we can pull our mold from the machine. We can remove the back. We can see our part that's formed inside. And to remove the part, you simply press the back of the ejection button, and that's all it is to it. So if you need to shoot uh, test specimens or you have other parts you want to shoot, you need an injection molding machine or a mold, uh, you can visit us at manninginnovations.com or drop us an email at manninginnovations at gmail.com. Thanks for watching.